Vegan Magnums, yo! Oh, no, wrong video. Vegan Magnum. Mm mm mm. Don't they. Oh, shit. Now, if like me you're reluctant to buy ice cream molds, just get some of these and empty them into an unused bottle of your favourite vegan refreshment. Here's one my girlfriend finished up this morning. Cut the tops off, dry them out, and make a small incision here. Get some chocolate, break it up, and then chop it. The smaller the better, which is what I keep telling my girlfriend, but she doesn't agree. Oh well, what does she know, stupid alcoholic girlfriend? Lick up all of the chocolate like so, into the microwave. Oh, almost forgot the coconut oil. This is going to thin out the chocolate. Turn it to half power, give it 30 seconds, then give it a mix. Back in for 15 seconds, mix 15 seconds, mix 15, mix 15, mix 15. And then you should have chocolate that's runnier than Usain Bolt. Spoon it into the molds, get it on all the sides, ensuring your bottom is thoroughly coated with chocolate. I managed to do three molds before I ran out of chocolate so I melted some more and for these last two molds I divided it into two bowls and dipped my nuts in the chocolate. More mixing into the molds. Look into my chocolate hole. Put them in the freezer, close it, try not to hit the camera and there we are. Okay, where do I buy lolly sticks? Well, that's easy, somewhere. But if you can't find them there, you could rip apart some pegs and use these. Now, we don't want to be wasteful, so why not use these as food clips? Simply take an open packet, pry open the clip, and then just slip it gently onto the... Yep, on... Oh, sometimes it takes a while. <laughs> Boom, what a simple solution to one of life's everyday problems. Amazing! Or if your children are being noisy, you could use it to shut them up, or you could use it as a nipple piercing, or even a fun toy. Hours of entertainment. You could also get some of these from your local and chip shop. Word of warning though, don't jam the ice cream violently into your mouth because you might end up with nostrils in your throat. Hmm, on second thought, let's cut those off and put the round end in. Who's a clever boy? I am. <laughs> Alright, these are looking good. Grab your ice cream, which used to be in this carton, but when I tried making these before, I took the carton, cut the bottom off, cut it into quarters, put the lolly sticks in, molded the ice cream using my mad skills, poured chocolate over it, but the ice cream went so soft so quick that I ended up with this monstrosity. Kill. Me. So I gave up, ate the monstrosity, wallowed in shame, and it was delicious. Woo! So, shove the ice cream into the expertly crafted moulds, be careful not to crack the chocolate. I've run out of vanilla, so one of these is going to be a double chocolate magnum. Hmm, kind of looks like a reverse colonic. Mm mm mm, my favourite. Get those lolly sticks in and yep, more chocolate! Make sure the chocolate here is exposed, because if this chocolate isn't connected to this chocolate, you'll end up with a floppy bottom! Okay, these are, look perfect! Put them in the freezer, take some Instagram pictures, and I'm just about ready for a magnum. Oh, no, that's Tom Selleck. Try again. There we go. Boom! Okay, so I probably should have cleaned the chocolate off the sides before I put it in the freezer. Oh well. Okay, remember that flat we made? Simply pull... Uh, uh, no, simply pull... No. Alright, cut it there and simply pull away the mould and way A giant rectangular magnum! What about the almond one? Wow, it's amazing. <laughs> and what about the hazelnut one? Whoa, okay, I know my methods are a bit crazy, but look at this, it's incredible! Okay, decoration. Dip these into there and stick them on there, and then some of these, oh, into there, onto the other side, and it's a meal fit for the queen! Why not spread some chocolate on this one? Grab some of these, stick them on, and wow, dazzling. Okay, it's time for the pièce de résistance. I'm gonna make a rainbow here, and then a neck, a mouth, an ear, nice horn, a green mane, and some stars for eyeballs, and it's a rainbow unicorn. You know, it's a shame this is an ice cream, because I could probably sell this for millions. Now on the other side, I'm gonna make a dollar bill sign, yo, with gold, because I'm a straight up gangster pimp and no tripping, homie. I'll bust a cap in your ass! Okay, so this one is done. We'll just fix that and then put it in the freezer. Wow, thank you for watching. I'm sorry if it wasn't very good, but oh my god, they really did taste amazing. Anyway, here's Tom Selleck to play us out. <laughs> Oh, what's this? Chocolate sticks and... What? No! It can't be! Okay, they look good, but I bet they taste... Oh, really good. Screw you, Tesco's! Beautiful. <laughs> oh, it looks so bad.